What's going on YouTube world? Austin Lewis here coming to you guys yet again with another YouTube video and in this video I'm gonna be covering some stumps some things that you might want to get into or eventually Actually be taking a look at and that ladies and gentlemen the pros and the cons to starting your own Turo business now ladies and gentlemen before I get started in this do me a favor and smash the thumbs up button on this video because supposedly it helps the YouTube algorithm and if you guys are brand new here make sure and come subscribe smash the subscribe button because again all new subscribers are welcome and we certainly appreciate every single one of you guys we are building one of the fastest growing YouTube communities on the platform of YouTube so I am excited but today's video I'm gonna cover some pros I'm gonna cover some cons to starting your very own Turo business. Now, before I jump into this video, I want you guys to understand Turo. When I say starting your own Turo business, I don't essentially mean starting your own business that an app that's like Turo. What I mean is you acquiring cars or using your very own car to go out there and earn money every single month on the month utilizing the platform of Turo. Now, one thing I recently done this last couple of months is I've actually purchased the vehicle. I put it onto Turo to make this YouTube video and my earnings were whopping anywhere from 50 to $100 rental a day. I was able to earn well over $500 its first month on being on Turo. Now, again, there is going to be some pros and there is going to be some cons when I do talk to you guys about the platform of Turo and really what it is that you could eventually get yourself into, but more importantly, what you also need to watch out for. Let's real quickly run through some pros that I think Turo has to offer each and every single one of you. The first thing that Turo offers is it allows you to one, pay your monthly payment. So. For example, if your payment is $300 and you drive a BMW 328i, if you put your car, your BMW on the platform of Turo, take some really good high quality photos and put it for 75 bucks or $85 a day and you get that rented out five times, ladies and gentlemen, 85 times five is going to be $425 in earnings. Now, one thing I do want to tell you guys, and this is a little bit of a con, is Turo, as obviously, is going to take some of that and only going to pay you a percentage of that $425. Now, again, one thing to take a look at is the pro, you are going to be able to pay your monthly payment. Your con is you're going to be out of car for five days. So you really have to outweigh is paying your monthly payment worth being without a car for five days days and if it is then absolutely amazing after your percentages again i'm going to read this to you guys here you will earn anywhere from 60 percent to 92 percent of the price fees and charges you set depending on your location and essentially your host protection program so at the end of the day if you have a really nice car then you probably want to have the best insurance and host protection program as possible on the platform of turo which is going to get your earnings right around 60%, 40% is gonna go to Turo. Where if you're like just driving a beater and you're driving something that you don't really care about and if somebody you know hits it or does something like that, you'll just fix it or you're betting against them uh, actually, you're essentially gambling, then you can earn upwards of 92.5% earning. So again, let's just say somebody rented it out for five days at $85, that would be $425 in profit. Your take home is gonna be 92.5%, which is gonna be $393.12, ladies and gentlemen. So, pro is you can pay your monthly payment. Con is you're out five days without a car. And not only just that, but you're profiting $93 off of those five days for them renting out your car. Now, here's also something that you guys do have to consider. When people do rent your car, they're renting your car to do what? To drive it. So at the end of the day, you have to look at the pluses and the minuses and understanding that when somebody rents your car out and you have 100 miles per day, 
That's essentially 500 miles that somebody has the opportunity to drive your car without getting paid more fees and more taxes. So at the end of the day, is Turo I think worth it? Now, the beautiful part that I love about Turo is once you get one monthly car payment paid for and you start earning maybe an extra 100 or 200 or $300, you then can go purchase another car and do exactly the same thing. Take that $300 profit that you make every single month, you're paying down that car that's getting used frequently in Turo at least five times a month. You're buying another car that's getting used again five times a month. Now you're making $600 a month because you're making $300 profit off of both cars. You're paying down both cars, so in a matter of five months, six months, 12 months, or two years, your cars are gonna be 100% percent paid off, 100% debt free. So now you essentially are going to be having free cars with again, some passive income. I understand at the end of the day, the value of the cars are going to depreciate just because every single drive, every single mile that is put on these cars is going to diminish the value of these cars. Now, do I think it's a phenomenal business model? Absolutely. Do I think it's somebody should just quit their job and go absolutely all in? No, ladies and gentlemen, I do not believe that. But I do believe just to, to, to create some cash flow, just to create some passive income. If renting out your car five days a month pays the monthly payment and you're able to save the $300 or $400, then why not do that? I understand that might be smaller thinking, but you have to understand the season that it is that you're in. I'm not talking about going out there and making that $10,000 a month utilizing the platform of Turo, which I'm sure there's people that actually do that. I'm just talking about how to drive your car for free utilizing the platform of Turo. Turo, ladies and gentlemen. Austin Lewis here saying, if you guys got any value whatsoever in this video, make sure and drop in the comment section down below. Make sure and smash the thumbs up button if you guys haven't already. And again, drop in the comment section what you guys would like to see in future videos because it is absolutely welcome. I appreciate each and every single one of you guys. Austin Lewis here saying, we'll see you guys in a future YouTube video.